Hi guys. Uh, today we will see how we can translate a WordPress content into any of the other language. Right. Let's say you have a blog and you want to reach out to the global audience. You want that every person can read your content in their own local language. Let's say the people are living in France and Russia. Most of them do not speak English, right? So how you can communicate with them or how uh, they will get benefit from your blog or your content. So they need their local language in your website, right? So that they can understand your blog. So today we will see how we can uh, like translate our website content into any of the global language using one of the wordpress plugin that is called translate press right so uh, let's check the process installation process let me check the installation process and other settings how we can uh, uh, install it at the back end of our wordpress website and how we can use it uh, uh, and how we can translate the blog content thank you guys now we have reached to our uh, uh, dashboard right and uh, uh, in this dashboard uh, the website is very basic if you will see it will look something like this right it's very basic and uh, like this is a sample blog uh, which is showing up right so we have to translate this and we have to uh, do this automatically we don't need to create pages for all the languages right so here what we will do we need actually these two plugins translate press multilingual this is the free plugin you can install it uh, you can go to add new plugin and here you can type translate And you can use this one so I have already installed it so it's showing me activate so we can activate it next uh, here you can find the different languages right if you want to add this language you can uh, uh, do it uh, let me remove these languages okay so by default the languages this one right English is the default language right now we have to install one more uh, translate press actually this is a, a paid plugin right translate press business so you can activate this you will get a file something like this zip file translate press so you have to install it by add new plugin and then upload the plugin and you can choose file and just upload it from here right otherwise as I have already uploaded then we have to just activate this translate press business now it is already activated now we will move to uh, check the translate press setting so go to setting and go to translate press uh, now guys you can see here are few languages already uh, like activated let's say I want to add Russian language right so here Russian let me choose the Russian and add it now Russian language has been added now if you want uh, so in this way you can add the language and save the change now here you can set uh, whether you want full language name with flags or just only flags or only full name of language 
what else you want you can uh, choose here you want this translator at the top right you can choose top right bottom left bottom right top left you can choose as per your requirement right next is go to automatic translation now here you have to enable this automatic translation and currently it provides three external provider for automatic translation that is translate press ai google translate v2 and deep l so currently i am just uh, using deep l right so for deep l you have to go to deep l uh, this you have to log in to your deep l account and here in this uh, profile image you can go to account you can go to account next when you will go to this uh, uh, this means I have a free subscription for this currently you can get a paid subscription as well because free subscription will not going to support uh, some of the languages and here in the subscription account and API key and limits you can choose this one and here you can just copy this API key and just put it here so I have already pasted it and it said this and it will also ask whether it, you have a pro account or the free account so I have currently free account so I just pasted it like this and then save it right and now uh, there are few add-ons as well so SEO pack multilingual languages so there are some uh, deep L automatic translation so there uh, it's already activated automatic user language detection so some of the uh, plugins add-ons you can say is uh, it's it is uh, recommending and uh, so it's a paid plugin right now let me check what happened at our front front end right so just check it now you can see here you can get a language switcher right you can from here you can change the language currently it is in which language it is in english language uh, moments and tangle threads so this is english now i want to change it in spanish now you can see it's already now it's already changed it in spanish right definitely it's changing automatically so there will be some uh, errors uh, in the conversion uh, then you can change the German right you can change it into German okay you can change it into Russian so the first time when you will choose a language it will create a copy for that particular language a separate page for that particular language but uh, if you will choose it again it will be a bit faster right it will be a bit faster as like when when we have chosen the Russian for the first time so it was taking time but now if we will choose it's like already created the copy so it will like sh show us fast right so in this way you can uh, change the la uh, translate your website right so uh, so in this way uh, so in this way we can translate our uh, website hope this uh, tutorial is helpful and if you have any question you can ask that in the comment i will surely try to answer each and every question thank you hi guys hope this helped if you are looking to create your own website for your business or might be your you are planning to sell your products through your website you can connect with me i will surely help you in creating your online presence 
through website and even if you are looking for someone who can manage your ad campaigns you can connect with me i can help you in that as well so uh, the number is given with below either you can connect with me through call or you can message me in whatsapp as well thank you very much